Imagine zipping through the city in a Tesla that costs less than a used sedan, $15,990 to be exact. That's the Tesla Model 2, and it's not just a dream anymore. It's set to hit the streets by November 2025, powered by a revolutionary aluminum ion battery. Elon Musk's been tight lipped, but leaks reveal this budget EV could redefine affordability with blazing fast charging, epic range, and unmatched safety. Forget everything you thought you knew about cheap cars. This is Tesla's boldest move yet. Let's dive into why Musk's ditching lithium, what makes aluminum ion tech a game changer, and whether this EV is worth your hard earned cash. Tesla's no stranger to shaking things up. From the Cybertruck's tank-like build to the self-driving Cybercab, they've turned impossible into inevitable. The Model 2 is their ticket to making EVs for everyone, not just the elite. Priced at $15,990 after federal tax credits, $23,490 without, it undercuts a base Toyota Corolla or Honda Civic, yet packs Tesla's tech-forward DNA. With Chinese rivals like BYD churning out $10,000 EVs, Tesla's betting on a new battery to stay ahead. Leaked prototypes at Fremont show a sleek, no-frills crossover ready to disrupt the budget market. Why ditch lithium? Lithium-ion batteries, like the LFB cells in the Model 3 and Y, are solid but pricey. Their costs swing wildly. Lithium prices spiked 500% at one point, as Musk himself griped. Cobalt and nickel, common in lithium batteries, add to the expense with cobalt hitting $80,000 per ton amid ethical and supply chain woes. Aluminum ion batteries, however, use abundant, cheap aluminum, 8.2% of Earth's crust versus lithium's 0.006%. At $2,200 per ton and mined in over 40 countries, aluminum's a stable, budget-friendly choice. This lets Tesla slash the Model 2's 53-kilowatt-hour battery cost to $3,100 versus $5,300 for an LFB pack, saving $2,000 per car. At Tesla's planned million-unit production, that's billions in savings, keeping the price ultra-competitive. So, what's an aluminum-ion battery? Unlike lithium-ion cells, where lithium ions carry a single charge, aluminum ions carry three moving three times more energy per ion. This boosts energy density to 500 watt-hours per kilogram, double the 250 WH slash kg of typical lithium-ion batteries. For the Model 2, this means a 53 kilowatt-hour pack delivers a 300-mile range, despite its small size. A long-range version could push further, though it'll cost more, likely $28,000 to $30,000. These batteries charge faster, too, up to 1,000 kilowatts in lab tests, potentially fully charging in three minutes. Real-world speeds for the Model 2 should hit 250 to 350 kilowatts, reaching 80% in 10 to 15 minutes, crushing the 20 to 40 minutes of lithium-ion EVs on V3 superchargers. This speed tackles range anxiety, making the Model 2 a no-brainer for urban commuters. Safety's another win. Aluminum ion batteries use a non-volatile ionic liquid electrolyte, stable up to 200 degrees Celsius, virtually eliminating fire risks. Stanford tests show they withstand punctures, crushing, and short circuits without sparking or overheating, unlike lithium ion cells prone to thermal runaway. With an operating range of 5 degrees Celsius to 85 degrees Celsius, the Model 2's battery thrives in Canada's winters or Arizona's heat, cutting maintenance and insurance costs. Plus, aluminum's eco-friendly. Recycling it uses just 5% of the energy needed to mine it, slashing the carbon footprint of battery production. Durability? Aluminum ion batteries are beasts. Their graphene or carbon-based electrodes resist degradation, avoiding lithium ions dendrite issues that cause short circuits. Tests suggest up to 10,000 charge cycles. 20 years of use versus lithium ions 3,500 cycles, about seven years. This means longer warranties, higher resale value, and lower ownership costs, making the Model 2 a budget buyer's dream. But it's not perfect. In sub zero temps below minus 20 degrees Celsius, aluminum ion batteries lose 10 to 20% range and charge slower, a concern for colder regions like Canada or the northern U.S. Teslas likely working on fixes. But it's a hurdle for now. 
Still, the supercharger network ensures charging is rarely an issue for most drivers. The Model 2's design screams efficiency. Leaked prototypes show a compact crossover, 20% smaller than the Model 3, with simple headlights instead of fancy light bars. Single-pane acoustic glass replaces double-glazed windows, and a metal roof swaps out the panoramic glass for better insulation and lower costs. Inside, fabric seats ditch vegan leather, seat heating's gone, and the audio drops from 15 to 10 speakers. No rear screen or RGB ambient lighting, just white LEDs and a Cybertruck-inspired angular console. A standard steering wheel and stock-free, touchscreen-heavy controls keep it cheap. Even the trunk skips a power liftgate. These cuts aren't flashy, but they make the $15,990 price possible while keeping Tesla's sleek aesthetic and tech core. The EV market's tough, cost, range anxiety, and charging gaps keep gas cars in play. The Model 2 tackles all three. It's cheaper than rivals. Its 300-mile range beats most budget EVs, and fast charging plus Tesla's network ease infrastructure woes. Competitors like BYD and GM stick to LFP or NMC batteries, hitting performance ceilings, while Tesla's aluminum ion leap gives it an edge. By November 2025, at Tesla's annual meeting, we'll see if the Model 2 lives up to the hype. For now, it's a bold bet to make EVs accessible, trusted, and built to last. Is it worth buying? At $15,990, with cutting-edge batteries, solid range, and Tesla software magic, it's a steal for commuters, young buyers, or anyone eyeing an EV without breaking the bank. It's not a luxury ride, but it's a revolution in affordability.